find the general solution for this differential equation, this dE. First step, we have to express our dy dx as a subject. So to simplify this, remove it, will become negative x cubed. At the same time, we divide divide by y squared. So we haven't known yet this is this is separable or I integrating factor until second step whether you can factorize the x or y completely. So this one we observe we can factorize one over y squared. So you can notice that your variable x and y here they're they're in one factor completely. So this is factor of y. This is factor of x. So from here we know this is using method of separable variable can be separate. Okay. Then how are we going to separate it? The factor y all collect back to the left hand side. The x thing all leave it to the right hand side. So that's so this y square we're going to move to the left hand side, it will multiply y y square. Meanwhile, this dx respect to x will multiply to the right hand side will time with x cubed. So this is our third step. Separate the factor. Then we are going to solve it means we are going to start in the grid both side. In the grid both side in order to find out, find out what is your solution, what is your y. So to integrate y squared, power plus 1 over new power. Respect to y. So to integrate x squared, also same formula, power plus 1 over new power plus c. So this one haven't finished yet, haven't get the solution yet. We have to simplify. So let it y cubed equals to negative 3 over c. Then 3 times c. 3 is a constant. c is a constant. Remain a constant. So no need to represent at 3c. No need to make the constant complicated. Okay, remain it is a single term in constant. We know this is constant, this is constant. How we know it is constant? Because your variable here only y and x. Other than that, it means it is constant. means your unknown here only y and x. Alright, so lastly, simplify until you get y. Let only consider your general solution. So, keep move it, keep root. So this is general solution.